Welcome to That Gay Kid, and this is going to be a Q&A, my first one. And so I asked you guys on Instagram what you, um, like, what questions you wanted to ask me. And I gave you permission to ask me any type of question, and I'm going to be completely honest with you on every question. Now, I'm not going to get to all of them because there's 110 comments, but I'm going to go at it totally random. I'm just going to pick names and I will say your name, whoever asked the question. So I'm going to scroll all the way to the top and start from there. All right. I'm going to do the first question because, you know, why not? They're the first comment. Anyways, Kaylee.com asked, how old were you when you came out? Well, I guess 17 is when I came out to my family. I was like 15 when I came out to all my friends. The next question is from Epic Awesome Meanie said, what is your hobby slash hobbies? Um, Instagram, <laughs> that's my hobby. And y'all should know this, but yeah. And if, I guess you could say if I had more than one, it would be Instagram and hanging out with my friends. So, my next question is from Altamaria, and it said, when did you finally realize that you were gay? Well, um, when I started realizing that I was looking at the guy instead of the girl in public. <laughs> so, yeah. I, I guess I always knew, but... I just didn't always want to accept it. But I am proud of who I am and I love myself. And you should love yourself too. Okay, the next question is from the Mistfit, Mistfit G Girl. Sorry if I said your name wrong. I apologize if I say y'all's names wrong. Anyway, she said, what's your favorite color? And then in parentheses, I don't know what to really ask. Oh, and I love you so much. Well, I love you so much too. Thank you for following my account and asking me a question. Yeah. Anyways, my favorite color is purple because I just love the color purple. It's just so... I don't know. I just like that color. All right. Super Woolockville asked me, what do you look for in a guy? Honestly, I look for like a really good personality. I don't care about your looks. I don't care about if you're rich or you're poor or anything like that. If you're sweet to me and you can sit there and make me laugh and just make me happy, then I'm happy. That's what I look for in a guy. Okay. Um, underscore AJ Perry underscore said cake or death death because I hate cake. I am not a cake fan. I like brownies. Um, sometimes I like cookies, but cake is just too sweet for me. I, I don't like it. So yeah, I'd die. I would die. I'm sorry, but I would die. <laughs> um, I underscore twerk underscore four underscore food period stamps. Will you marry me? Um, I don't really know you, but I admire your admiration towards me, so in the internet world, I guess I would marry you. Yeah. Okay. Next question. Um, how, oh wait, hold on. YouTuber Forever Anna, how do you deal with hate? Well... Normally, I don't always catch on to it because it is kind of hard to keep up with 57,000, well, oh, 58,000, my apology, but, um, I just delete it and block the person who's hating and then delete everyone else's hate comments towards that person because I don't like hate on my page. So, yeah, that's how I deal with hate. Um, LGBTQA underscore shoutouts said, what's your opinion on very religious people? They're religious, so what? I mean, everyone is something, you know? We have Christians, Buddhists, Muslims, atheists, you know, me personally, I'm not any type of religion. I believe in, 
I do believe in a God and I believe in he created me the way he wanted me to be or else why would I be here? But if you're religious, then go ahead and be religious. It doesn't bother me as long as it's not affecting me in any way. And it, I don't know, just go on with what you normally do. Ethan Gaga 12 asked me, do you have any regrets? I would think everybody has regrets. So, yes, I'm not even gonna lie. I totally have regrets. I regret a lot of stuff. But there's nothing I can do about it because once it's done, you know, it's already been done. Can't go back in time. Bleeding underscore music 23, Taiwan, asked me, would you ever get someone's name other than family tattooed on you? My dog, yeah, Ivy. I love her. She's laying on my bed right now. But that's probably the only name I'll ever get tattooed on me. I don't really want no one's name tattooed on me. Unless it's mine. So, hmm. Boredom.kills asked, Can you say aliens among us? I don't even know what that means, so I'm guessing no. But... I don't know. No, I can't. I'm sorry. Let's see who's next. Story underscore official 227 asked, are your parents supportive? Very supportive. When I told, I was so scared to tell my parents because, you know, my dad's in the army and I was just raised by like military parents. That's about all I can really say. But now they're really supportive. And I really appreciate how much support they've given me and how they respect me for who I am. So I apologize if your parents aren't supportive. Just know that it'll it'll get better. I promise you. And I love all of you. So don't ever feel like you're not loved. We underscore R underscore the underscore runaways underscore ask. What do you look for in a guy? And I think I already answered that question. So I guess I just said your name. And you got your answer a while ago. Um, the Flash Shoes asked me, did you lose anyone when you came out of the closet? No. Everyone was supportive. I think. I don't really... Yeah, I believe everyone was supportive. <laughs> okay. King June 10 asked me, what is your dream job and why? Now, this is going to sound... I have two. This is going to sound, the first one's going to sound really, like, lame, but I want to be an accountant because I like math. Math is really easy to me. It just, it comes, except trigonometry, I, I didn't do the best in trig. I mean, I got, I got, like, a very borderline B, but, yeah, every other class I've had A, A, because I love math. It just, it's easy. So, yeah, um, I don't even remember what the question was. Oh yeah, and my second one is I would love to be a gay activist because I could just talk about it all day on how we are human and we deserve equality. I mean, what else? Why wouldn't we? We're not aliens from a different planet. We're just not the same as you. And technically nobody's the same, so think about that. A underscore Aaron underscore Ro... R-O-E-D-L underscore said, quick, pizza or bacon? Pizza, because I don't like pork. But I do like bacon. I just get scared to eat pork ever since I watched the movie Contagion. So, yeah. I'm underscore no, underscore good, underscore for, underscore you said, if you could be any race in the world besides your own, what would it be? Um... I don't want anybody to take this the wrong way because I'm not racist in any... Anyway, I'm not. But I think I would be either, like, Indian or Asian just because they're really smart. They are really smart. So, yeah. And I, I would love to be smart. Okay. Kevin underscore no no said, The Walking Dead. Yeah, The Walking Dead, that is my favorite show in the world. I love that show, so yes, The Walking Dead. Um, Nail, I'm just, no, okay, 
N-A-E-L underscore G-B asked, Who is your favorite Victoria's Secret angel? Well, I don't wear Victoria's Secret, and so I don't know who the angels are. So, yeah, we're just going to leave that question hanging. Okay. Tyler dot is dot the dot name said, Who are your top three YouTubers and why? Number one, Mark E. Miller, because he is sexy, he is inspirational, he's funny, he knows how to make you, he knows how to make your day go from rock bottom to like way up. I love him. He has always been my inspiration ever since I created this page and I, um, I just, I love him. Two, Ethan Hethcote, his boyfriend is sexy, inspirational, about the same as Mark. It's just there's, they're two different personalities put together. So it just makes it 10 times better when you watch both of them. And three, um, the Hannah and Kaylee show. That is this, or I don't, it's just called Hannah and Kaylee, but yeah, it's the Hannah or tips and Hannah from Kaylee and Kaylee. They are from Louisiana, which is right next to me. I'm only 15 minutes away from the Louisiana border. They, um, they are so funny. Oh my gosh. They just, they can make you laugh. They really can. And it just connects to me because I live in the South, so I know what they're talking about. It's crazy. But, yeah, those are my three favorite. Now, I also like Red Rum Romeo, and y'all know him from Instagram. If you don't, follow him because he's awesome. And he is my internet buddy, internet bestie. Anyways, yeah. So, if I didn't get to your questions, it's because my video is already at 13 minutes and it was only supposed to be 10. So, I love you all so much. Thank you for watching and subscribe, like, everything. Um, and I will be doing another Q&A, so don't feel like you got left out. Okay? I love you all. Bye. Why are you putting it in my bag?